Hello! In this video, I'm going to talk about what I mean by freeze framing in piano practice. This is an art song by Gabriel Faure. I'm learning it for a festival where I'm a collaborative piano fellow. And in this passage, there's a B natural that I just always want to play as A sharp, and I need to correct this. You'll see that part of this measure is penciled in. What I've done there is called redistribution. In redistribution, what I've done is take this stuff that looks like it should be in the left hand, and I've moved it up to the right hand staff. This is the B natural that I keep wanting to play as A sharp. So what I'm going to do is approach that passage at the normal speed I'm practicing at, which is certainly not full speed right now. But then when I get to the problem passage, what I'm going to do is slow down so much that it is going to be absolutely foolproof. I will not be able to get it wrong even if I tried. This way, what you're doing is programming the correct notes into your brain and fingers. So I will start at the beginning of this measure. Enjoy that double sharp. Okay, so that was a freeze frame. The B natural was correct. However, I delayed the D sharp that should have been right under it. So what I'm going to do is freeze frame again and I'm going to slow it down even a little bit more to make sure I get it completely right. Okay, that went a bit better. Now we're going to freeze frame again. Okay, that went even better. I was able to incorporate the decrescendo marked there. And so what you'll want to do is repeat this process maybe at different speeds to make sure your brain stays active through the process. You always want to do something different every time in your practicing. And this will help you deprogram a tendency to insert a wrong note or some other wrong thing into your score as you're learning it. Happy playing!